so expensive. Um, so I've been doing this thing on this for a while, and like I no one hasn't done an update in um, basically two months, and I would have had the van done if I didn't wait to move it or whatever. But it has been really good smoothly, and I'm still trying to get the mechanic to come out and take out my van, but my van's all finalized, the tires are my name, all that good stuff, and, like, it's a very slow process, and I don't like how slow it's going, but I'm hopeful that it will keep on going, um, um, let's see, so, there's a couple reasons why I chose this lifestyle. First off, I like living in small spaces. Um, I don't really like big spaces that have a lot. Um, second, I just want to be out. I don't really need to be in schools or a backyard or in the countryside a lot more. And I feel like I can, I feel like I'm being kept inside indoors and I just want to be outdoors. And like a really fun experiences and stuff like that. And then, three, like, stuff that I don't know, like, um, um, it's very cheap, it's very cheap to get a van, yeah, so the kind of van I have is a Dacia Nissan with tonal wires, uh, van, and, like I said, I'm trying to get my mechanic to come up, I don't care, my hair's all damaged, probably like next week we'll have the mechanic come up and um, just contact me and stuff like that, and we're going to try to get it up someday. Um, after I get home, I'll, drop, I'll say how much everything costs, because then I won't, like, start, like, putting the furniture in there that could be painted it, um, putting some wood in there. So let's start by saying that I ripped the entire carpet out. It was super nasty and dirty. Like, look at this. It's like full of dirt and it's got like this weird cardboard underneath. And I'm just not going to do carpet. Like, it just gets so dirty and wet and really nasty. So, but as you can see, I don't know if you can see clearly, but there's not very much rust. And as you see on the door, there's like some weird stuff had a chemical reaction overall this van is a very good size for me it is small and it's not it's like pretty spacious so so I'm showing you the inside of my van it's still pretty dirty but I've cleaned some of the floor as you can still see it's caked with red dirt my brother's like fixing the little sealant thing on the door still showing you around I'm gonna spray it out with water and all that. Um, I applied insulation on top of the roof and yeah there's so basically I'm showing you that I blast it with water it's all clean and shiny and I sprayed it with anti-rust spray I'm showing you that I am applying insulation and I'm temporarily sticking it on with Gorilla duct tape and it should hold for a little bit but it's not a permanent fix I am going to put wood on top of it, so I'm just showing you, and I also did some insulation foam for the cracks and stuff, and make sure everything was clean and properly evenly coated, and all that, and I did put the solar panel on top of the roof and drilled holes in my roof. So here's the insulation, this is where it's going to be. I basically place it here and it's a little kit it's a hundred watts so yeah it's a two-person job and yeah this is me sitting up on the roof of my van thanks for watching it guys and I hope you like this video and give it a thumbs up and yeah and thanks for watching the video bye